o'clock, temperatures really plunged behind the cold front that swept through here last night. About 20 to 25 degrees colder now than it was at this time last night. We're down to 45 degrees under mostly cloudy skies in Pittsburgh. Light wind out of the north, 5 miles per hour. Temperatures around the area already seeing some upper 30s. Up to the north, up into Franklin, Clarion, upper 30s right now. We're down to 41 in Connellsville. Look at this 37 in Somerset right now. A little chilly in Washington at 43, Cranberry at 44. Warmest spot we see is 47 down in Morgantown. Lows down to the upper 30s by tomorrow morning. A little bit chillier than what we had this morning, but take a look at the almanac. Our numbers, that 63 for the high today, that happened just after 1 this morning before the cold front swept through and the temperature crept down the rest of the night and through the day. The low officially 45, our normal low is 41. We picked up just under two tenths of an inch of rain with those showers and we'll get a little bit more shower activity tomorrow, a little more on Monday. Not any big super soakers coming, but just kind of occasional showers here and there for about the next two to three days. Here you see the temperature change over the past 24 hours. Butler dropped 26 degrees, Pittsburgh 24 degrees in just 24 hours. So we'll stay a little chilly overnight and then we start to rebound a bit as we head toward the middle of this week. Cloud cover here and there overnight, mostly overcast. Then we'll get a little break here and there as we head toward the morning. But another wave of low pressure swings through here tomorrow afternoon and that will give us those showers in the afternoon and evening. So you see that little bit of rain to the south and look what's looming just off to the west. It's not coming our way, but there is quite a bit of snow that's headed toward the Rockies late tomorrow night. And then this is the leading edge of some very chilly air and some snow into portions of the Dakotas and Minnesota today. So that will fizzle out by the time it gets here. But our temperatures are definitely getting cold enough that uh, this is about the time of year that we start to see our first snowflakes. We won't this week. By tomorrow afternoon, when we get most of these showers pushing through, we'll be back into the upper 40s, lower 50s. There you see by 11 o'clock, just scattered showers leading to some lighter steady rain Monday morning that will filter into a few showers by Monday afternoon. So keep the umbrella handy later tomorrow and then most of the day just off and on Monday. By Tuesday morning, we get the last little bit of these showers pushing through and Wednesday we get back to sunshine and a nice little swing up in temperatures. So tonight 38 under mostly cloudy skies tomorrow south of I 70 and along I 70. We could see a few morning showers. Most of us won't see any showers until after two or three in the afternoon. So we'll call it afternoon and evening scattered showers tomorrow. The high only 52 Monday scattered showers throughout the day 57 Tuesday down to 52 Wednesday sunshine 60 50s the rest of the week.